Ooh. All right, so I'm Hamid, Raman dancer, choreographer. Well, now recently added to the list, um, television producer. Yeah, that's me. And I'm Matthew McQueen, dancer, tutor, choreographer at Extreme Dance Academy. Mm -hmm. Also, kind of a new member of Eclectic and understudy of Hamid Rahman. We take a little rest um, from competing at the World Hip Hop Dance Championship this year as Eclectic, but we will be going back to the championships as Mega Crew, as a Mega Crew. Um, this Mega Crew consists of members of Eclectic, Blackout, Unstable The Gift, Gentlemen, New Edition from out of Point Fourteen, um, and a bunch of other different dance crews and individual dancers. So we all combine and we form one crew to represent Trinidad and Tobago in the best possible way at the World Hip Hop Dance Championships. Well, it's a challenge, it's a challenge because it's no longer like an eight member crew, it's like 34 members? 35 members. 35 members. Correct. Yeah, so, so it's a lot of different opinions and that kind of thing. But we all trying to strap down and get, get the work out just in time because, I mean, we only have like a month again? Three weeks. That. Only three weeks again. So initially, um, the TNT mega crew, the massive size it was, it wasn't always the 35 members was actually two different em like entities. One yes, one crew was consists of different dance crews, and another mega crew that consists of different dance crews. Mm -hmm. We had TNT and we had Collab, and we believe that together we could actually make a bigger impact than divided. So we came together, stronger together. Well, we we both competed at the um, the local leg of the competition. And um, both routines were strong, both routines had, had a decent delivery and we eventually decided that it would be, we would be stronger together so we had a meeting, um, all the members of the crew, well not all the members, all the leaders of the crew, different crews um, had a meeting and we came together, together and decided to join forces and here we are. Well, we've been practicing for about, what, three weeks? Yeah, approximately yeah. that. Yeah, about three weeks. and. Um, the development is is challenging because I mean, like I said, we have different personalities. We're just trying to get the best work out, the best possible work, so that we could represent Trinidad and Tobago in the best possible way, you know. But the routine is amazing, and I can't wait to see the end, end result. When it comes to putting together the routine, we have at the moment three head choreographers, and we usually get support from team members as well in terms of ideas and. Uh, like opinions as well in terms of where they think the routine should head. Um, it's, it's actually not 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 easy. <laughs> it's not easy at all because with the three entities, that's three different visions. Who's the three entities? As in the three entities are Hamid Rahman, myself, Matthew McLean, and Kurt Alexander. Well, he's not here. So. He's not here right now, but um, he's actually getting business done right now. But when those three are trying to push this way, th this is all, that is what actually ex exactly what happens there. <laughs> <laughs> when, you have, when you have three strong choreographers trying to put something together, but hopefully, you know, in the nick of time, we could always come back and spearhead things, right? Yeah, um, man, we optimistic. Right, so we have this event coming up on July 16th in Movie Town, um, Fiesta Plaza, and it geared towards us raising funds to compete at the World Hip Hop Dance Championship. So, we're really encouraging people to come out and support it. All the dance crews, all the major dance crews will be there, including some of your favorite soca artists as well. So it will be a huge, huge event, a huge movement. The event name is Stronger Together. Um, what it is, is not, it's not just you that's coming to pledge 150 towards the mega crew representing the country but also you're getting a, a full hand of entertainment from the top crews in Trinidad Tobago again big soca artist names I, should, I, should, I, I, I don't want to mention all no I can't mention none can't mention none Shh, secret but it's, it's just it's just supposed to be a, a fundraising event but also a, a show a concert 
hopefully it will be an annual thing because I mean we just try and try to jump off the summer in a big way you know that kind of thing so it's a long time we haven't had like an event a dance oriented event in Trinidad and Tobago where everybody could come out and enjoy and things so yeah so so far the response is amazing um we well we have different advertising agencies and also we um advertising on 96.7 thanks for the love and the the response is amazing a lot of people calling in and, and asking about the event and thing which is really really good so we hope that translates into people pledging actually pledging their 150 and come um also you could also go to any lullaby cellular outlet and pledge your donations to help um support the group we have um support from omg magazine media 21 experience effects uh 96.7 tv6 dance live tt mgi tt dance come L N Y T T and Lullaby Cellular. It's important for everybody to come out and support not only the general public but you know the government entities and private entities. I mean we doing this for the love of dance and for the representation of our country and we really and truly need the support. We have a lot of we have had a lot of support in the past and we just expect everybody to just come out and support the thing, you know. And also it is like a it's like a, a shelter also for the youths. Of, of the of the nation I should say because it, it it may sound shocking but a lot of youngsters just look up to dancing and dancing is actually involved in everything if you turn on the TV you might see a piece of dance going on so it's not only just we just want to represent the country but we also just want to help up a lot of youths who just need some sort of guidance and they could choose and dance inspire. as well yeah, yeah definitely because I mean like when I was coming up that's exactly how it was you know we, we i just saw michael jackson on tv and it inspired me to to just push forward until i saw a group called robbie six on party time and that just take me to the next level so the inspiration you know we would just like to inspire in a similar way just like how i was inspired you know so july 16th, 16th. fiesta plaza in fiesta movie town plaza. we just hoping that everybody really comes out in their massive numbers come and support man bring your whole family bring your mom bring your pups the young ladies you know bring all the friends fellas bring a team we need everybody to be on board just we need the backbone of this nation to to just reach one and we just need that mentality of everyone as us to see that we could drive for a medal we need everybody just to push us up so we could actually accept that medal definitely <laughs> <laughs>